Hey everyone, and welcome to a new episode of Get Good at OpenRC2. Now, you probably already know that you can change your map size. Um, normally you can do this in the scenario editor, but if you're playing on OpenRC2, you can also enable sandbox mode in the cheat menu. And uh, now if we open this, uh, the map menu, you can see we can change the map size. Normally there would be only one value here that you could change, but now there's actually two. Um, you can see uh, if we make the map size bigger using this. I'm using my scroll wheel by the way, so that's just a quick way to change it. Now uh, um, you can see that uh, as I'm trying to change it, it will always maintain a square shape. So both sides are, uh, are exactly the same size. But um, there's now a new button here in the middle. Uh, it's now enabled, which uh, gives us a square shape, but if we disable it, it now allows you to make a rectangular map. So you can just change uh, both sides uh, separately. Now you can see this button uh, stays disabled, so uh, um, it will not uh, try to uh, maintain a square shape. But if I change this uh, size back to 40, then the button becomes available again, and then we can make uh, another square. So yeah, um, this just allows you to make a, a, a rectangular map if you wanted uh, to. And I think this uh, can lead to some uh, really uh, interesting uh, map designs. Alright, hope you uh, enjoyed this tutorial, hope it's useful for you. If you uh, liked it, if it was useful for you, please consider giving it a like, it would really help out my channel. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you again in the next one. See you later. Bye.